Hello and good morning and uh, thank you for joining. I have a very interesting tool that I want to show you that is uh, mainly for people that run a hotel or an Airbnb or any sort of establishment where you want to keep track of guests, um, booking them in, booking them or checking them out um, and, and keep, keep track of various rooms and occupancy. This here is the tool that you're looking at. This is an Excel based tool that allows you to uh, to uh, to manage your guests here over here on the re right hand side you can see the various rooms and whether you have one room that you're managing two rooms five etc this allows you to do that it's very flexible and over on the top you can see the calendar you can see the months of the year the days of the week and going you can go back and forth and this allows you to go let's say right now I go move forward by a week and all of those bookings are mo moving with me uh, I can go back a week, a couple of weeks, you can go back several weeks, and this allows you to do that. And this is a very simple tool, a very easy to use tool, and it's all Excel based. And what you're seeing is basically all that there is to it. Now, this, these are the buttons that allow you to do most of the, most of the work. So right now, if I want to add a new uh, guest, I can just say add a new booking, and the information I can add it right here. So let's say I'm just going to add Freddie Mercury, who is going to be my guest, and Freddie's address is um, Test Street, and uh, just because I, I'm going to make it up here right now, let's say Freddie at test.com, and he's got a phone number that I can add, or a driver's license, or a uh, passport number right here. And I can add the room information right here. And let's say Freddy is coming on the 29th. So to 29th, I am going to have a, book, a room number five that's available. And he's going to be coming on the 29th, as I mentioned, 2017. He's going to be staying for five nights. And it automatically calculates the checkout day. And he just called and confirmed. That's great. Here I can add all the costs, but at this point, all I know is I'm going to be charging him $50 a night and it autom automatically calculates his total cost. I can add quite a few other things as well, but I can do that a little bit later. Right now, let's just add this information. And there it is. The new booking has been added. And let's just see Fred Mercury is right there coming on the 29th and coming, uh, leaving on the, on the 3rd. Well, let's see a couple of days later, Freddie calls and he's check ready to check in. Uh, let's just find Freddie here. Freddie, I'm going to start typing, and there he is, Freddie Mercury, and all his information that I had just added is right here for me. Let's say Freddie says, you know what, I don't want room number five, I want room number six. It's a nicer room, and uh, let's say that Freddie, while he's been waiting, he had a drink, and I can add that to his tally. Uh, he also had a dinner here while he was waiting, or while he was here. And I can add that here as well. He spent another $10 on food. And his total expenses are calculated right here. And the total is, is going to add that to his total. So I'm going to update that information. But you know what? He's checked in. It's not just confirmed. He's checked in. And I'm going to make that change as well. I'm going to update that information. And as you can see right now, it says customer information has been updated. Freddy's color changed because he's checked in and he moved from room four to uh, excuse me room five to room six all of that information is right here and that's really all that there is to it there's a couple of other things that you can do um, let's just sh show you here right now this allows you to as I mentioned change anything as you uh, as you uh, as you go back but you can cancel the booking which would take it off of this calendar and you can also once he's ready to check out, you can click check out, and that would change his color as well um, right there. Now, it allows you to print a receipt when you check out. So when you click check out, there's a information that will be printed here that you can print out for, the, for, the, for your uh, guest. And there's also a database here in the back that allows you to keep track of everybody that's come, that's checked in, checked out, has ever come to visit your hotel. But the most, the bulk of it, everything really happens here that allows you in a very easy and simple way to keep track of all of your rooms, all of the bookings, and all of the 
all of the activity that's happening here. If anybody wants to come and uh, take room number four around this time, it would say, hey, that room is taken. Um, you need to uh, assign a different room. So the system is very smart and very, uh, very easy to use, very simple, and uh, definitely something that if you have Excel on your laptop, um, you want to have just to manage your rooms, and it's just very, very easy and simple to use.